Hello folks, Johnny Morse here with Sack Caddy. We're here today to show you some of the few ins and outs uh, of the Sack Caddy, how convenient it is. We're out here on beautiful Labor Day weekend. I don't know about you guys, we had great weather. Uh, you can probably hear some boats going by, but we're gonna start out by showing you where the Sack Caddy's mounted. Uh, on most boats, we uh, mount them right here on the underneath of your battery compartment or bilge area lid, as you can see right here. We've got a blue one installed in this in the uh, Sack Caddy Nitro Z. The first thing you're gonna notice is uh, there's a hose, a couple of mounting clips, and here in the center is a feature, we're calling it the rough water speed wrap. And it's a Velcro strap, which gives you that extra, extra security uh, when you're in rough water situations or even trailering your boat. So when you get ready to use your sack caddy, you've caught a good limit of fish. Uh, first thing you're gonna do, climb up here on the back deck, undo your speed wrap, pop it out of the mounting holes, just stick it in your seat pedestal mount. That's all you gotta do, it's that easy. Now the sack caddy's ready to hang your weigh-in bag on it and start filling it up with water and getting your fish out of the box. Now, if you'll notice, there's a reinforced hose that runs up to the sack caddy. Now, this is plumbed into your live well system via a three-way valve. That three-way valve lets you select between discharging or recirculating your water, depending on your installation application, or filling your weigh-in bag through the sack caddy. Now, this hose being reinforced also gives you the option that if you feel you want to drop that lid back down, you're good. Uh, just don't stand on it because uh, I don't care what you're using. You're probably going to kink it if you stand on the hose, but you can drop your, your lid back down if you want. Well, I'm going to open mine back up, and I'm going to reach in here and grab my weigh-in bag. Now, when you go to hang your weigh-in bag on it, there's a little trick to it. you got two handles on all your weigh-in bags. What you want to do is you want to go your back handle. You want to put your fill hose through the back loop. Go up and bring your, your hoses inside the bag. Your bag is actually behind the hose, and now you can hang your back handle on the hose, or on the sack caddy like so. Now I'm ready to fill my bag. I'm gonna open this valve right here, turn on my discharge pump for my live well. And as you can see, the uh, weigh-in bag is now filling up with water. Now usually this will fill up uh, before you get five fish out, so You'll probably end up shutting it. You can shut it off here, or you can reach over and shut off your uh, pump, whichever one's closest to you, whichever one's more convenient. So now we're gonna go to the live well and uh, get some fish out. See, the, the bag's been filling up just for a few seconds now. And by the time you get a fish out of the live well, you're gonna have uh, enough water in that bag for a fish. I've got two little fish in here. We'll fish them out. especially if it takes this long to catch them. There's one. Now what I like to do is I'll pull this outside handle out, put your fish in, and hang your outside handle right back on. Now what this is doing is it's keeping those bag handles closed for you so your fish can't jump out. Now as you can see, the bag's getting pretty full. I'm gonna go ahead and go try to get this other fish before it fills up on me too bad. Sometimes they're easier to catch out of the lake than these giant nitro live wells, I'll tell you. Keeper number two, outside handle, drop the fish in. Now that bag's way got more water, enough water for two fish, so I'm gonna go ahead and shut it off. Shut my pump off. Now as you can see, my bag's being held upright. Uh, it's holding all the weight, all the fish. Pumps are shut off. Now when you get ready to go to the weigh-in, it's real simple. You just grab your both your handles of your weigh-in bag, pop it off, and now you're ready to walk to the scales. Using the sack caddy is that easy.